Hey, I'm Furball. What's up? I'm Bobby Freedom. Hey, today we're going to try some Kung Fu yes. in 3D. Um, have you ever played Kung Fu? Man, I have played Kung Fu. Whenever I was young, my cousin had a Nintendo, and this is one of the games they had, and I very distinctly remember once I stayed over there, and my cousin was not there, and my uncle played this game with me for like 20 minutes and uh mm. but it left an impression because i still remember oh. it now but oh. i remember it fondly you know i've kind of wanted to play it again since then and never have yeah well what? this one's looking kind of 3d like maybe not the characters but you know the the scenery i really liked the uh title screen on it it, it was really sticking the, out yeah i felt like the title oh my screen god had a, okay had so you're you're running around fighting and these guys throwing knives and shit at you man that ain't nice it's not Ooh. nice at all two player game a or b mm. all right it's uh, you're going from right to left huh is that, that true that is weird it's Hello. like backwards, but that's, I don't know, they they read from right Dude. to left, I guess. And... Dude, this, okay, this is cool. Man, <laughs> this is an excellent game. I am clearly a karate master. Dude, I like the little sound he makes. Yeah. Hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> Or excuse me, Kung Fu. I'm a Kung Fu master. So I'm like very chill while I'm telling you about it. Now why doesn't his knife hurt these other guys? It just goes right past them. You're the only Oh, Whoa. that was it for my Kung Fu adventure. Player two. What? This no. is all you. Huh. Huh. God, you like the... Dude, your huh. attacks are shit. so wicked. Oh shit. Ta cha. Ha! Who'd you get getting? Jump kick! Oh no! Oh, oh no! You, oh, you mother! Alright, well. You were still inspirational. That I'm was awesome. Yeah, I need, um. I gotta do better. I think, I think it's the input. Yeah, yeah, um. It's the controls. Um. <laughs> Man, what do you think of the style of this uh, game? You see this a lot in Nintendo games. It's like a, uh, it's like kind of a beat 'em up, like uh, Double Dragon or something like that. Mm-hmm. I don't, I like it. I'm not gonna say I like it better than Double Dragon because Double Dragon is clearly a superior game overall. But... Yeah, I mean, like they're backgrounds could have used a, a little more something mm -hmm. in this game you know but, they're weak but the gameplay is pretty cool like it oh, is crap i am enjoying it like playing I'm, I'm just, he's got his little karate, kung fu shoes on i believe the game is meant to be like a kung fu movie you know like that bruce lee movie where he goes in that uh oh, building shit. and it's fight everybody get his way through. Oh no! What movie is that? I don't remember the name. Enter the Dragon or something? Something like yeah. that. It may even be <laughs> literally that. I'm I don't know a whole lot of Bruce Lee movies. I know he's badass. Yeah, yeah. dude. My thing oh. too. Like, but I don't know like the names. Of, oh, I don't know him well. Stab me in the say. foot. <laughs> See, are we starting back at the beginning of the... It seems oh. like we are. That kind of sucks, dude. Yeah, like, and since the backgrounds don't change, it's like, are we making any progress? Like, what are we doing? <laughs> like, I know these guys start throwing knives, and then I die. Yeah, they're like knife guy there. Like, I don't, I don't know what's up. That was so clearly my own fault, though. It was my lack of skill and discipline. Man.
they just run up on you and start doing damage, right? Yeah. Crap. Ow! <laughs> you ate that thing. That was terrible. Well, I did some cool ass moves just then. God! Oh! I got, I got too excited. Yeah, so, I don't know if I was making any progress just then. Dude. Okay, so that was Kung Fu. 1984, this is an early Nintendo game. I'm gonna... Oh, you know, yeah, 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 it's definitely one of the original ones, and that's why, I like, the backgrounds aren't really all that, or whatever, but the gameplay was there, like, I really liked the variety of moves that he had, like, I had a few different kicks, he had a jump kick, like, I think there was a knee to the face I accidentally did, like, then you got the punches and stuff, like, I, I don't know, like, it seemed like he's pretty versatile, I was, man, uh, that guy with the knives, though, why don't you give me a damn knife? I was really into the moves as well. I thought the gameplay was excellent, but this is the deal. You know, we're playing it in the 3D emulator, and, you know, kind of as much as the game, we're judging how did we like it in 3D. And I've got to say, I feel like Zero was brought to it with 3D. Yeah, like, I mean, they tried to 3D the backgrounds, but... There's barely any background for him to do. The title screen's impressive. Well, yeah, and hey, I can't. I haven't done any of it personally, and so I can't. I have no idea how difficult it is. Oh yeah. I assume it is difficult, but see, like what we got to do is hack the ROM and just add in backgrounds to it. You know, like that way yeah. there's, you know, like throw in the Mario background behind it or something, <laughs> just so there's like something going on. You know, put a picture back there, and then... Boom. Yeah. Maybe, 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 you know, we'll have to hack Kung Fu and just add a little to it. Yeah. It was good, though. I like the game itself. Yeah. Yeah. I'm kind of curious, like, where does it go? Is it just this forever? Like, it's got a... It says we're on floor one, so I assume, like, maybe it'll look different if we got to a, a, a new think, stage. Well, you know... We'll have to hit this one with some Game Genie codes or something sometime. Oh, my goodness. That would be so freaking cool whenever we're doing it on HD on the cartridge and the console, man. Yeah. Revisit Kung Fu Game Genie Edition. <laughs> we could totally... Um, I would totally. love that. You know, I never had a Game Genie. No kidding. Oh, Game Genies are fun just to play with because it's like hexadecimal sort of so like you can just type in some code and see what it does it's it, so weird. it doesn't have to be a code out of a book like you could just make some shit up and then it could completely crash the game you know you never know it might do nothing yeah you just uh, write down the ones that work and yeah or you know and then there's websites nowadays to where oh my god you can find all kinds of codes that people have come up with for everything oh man you know i will say this though just putting myself in the mindset of 1985 this is an excellent game right really thinking about it like, well it's difficult so you can put a lot of time into it yeah my big it's complaint fun. like i said it's just kind of the background is just plain yeah which i mean they put all their effort into the gameplay it seems you know yeah, you like, can only imagine there must have been a trade-off involved yeah maybe because of the size like a you know of the the roms back then were small so yeah. you know like and the mappers and stuff like maybe that's all they could fit I don't know but oh, I, I'd say it's worth playing and I, I, I'd like to play it some more and Would actually say, see where it goes you know is it worth playing on 3D at this point well the 3D didn't take away from it agreed but not like some things where it yeah. kind of makes it yeah, so sometimes you, the 3D is just like, oh my god, what is happening? Well, it gets a what little was that? confusing on Elevator the action, I believe, that we yeah. played that was... Or no, 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 no. It was Dr. Mario. Dr. Mario. That was, was the pain. one. And but, I've played a lot of Dr. Mario, and in 3D, it, there were challenges that yeah. <laughs> were not present in the regular game. Yeah, it game. made it an all-new level of hard, and it just, that was not good. So at least it didn't do something like that to Kung Fu here. But, 
And the little dragons there look cool. I keep thinking <laughs> that, like, they they did the the 3D thing with the two little dragons. And what is that? Okay, so at the top, you've got, okay, the little guy's head, which is your lives, I assume. And next to it's a little dragon. Yeah, I'm what not is, sure. Like, maybe you get some cool dragon powers or something? I don't know. It's enticing. I know, like you know that dragon is something, so you want to play it. I know. Out. I need a game genie code to see what the dragon is, and then yeah, hmm, yeah, I dig it. I recommend it. Yeah, you know, same. And I, three D or on the cartridge, I don't think it's gonna be um, too much of a difference. Uh, you know, might as well play just the cartridge if you've got it. Yeah, I'm looking forward to revisiting it on the cartridge sometime. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but... Yeah? Yeah. Kung Fu. If you like this kind of video, click the like button, you know, and uh, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell, and we'll see you next time.